my dears. I hope you're having an awesome evening. So today's subject is on really stepping into sharing your truth and sharing your message, sharing your soul's work and sharing whatever the Holy Spirit is guiding you to share that day uh, and sharing it unapologetically and really sharing it boldly. I know a lot of us get caught in the trap of what people will think, what people will say, or should I post that, maybe I shouldn't, maybe it's a little too extreme, maybe they just won't get it. Um, we get caught in this cycle um, or this overthinking uh, process in our heads, I know I do. Um, and it's just, it's it comes from, and it's rooted from not being enough, not feeling like you're enough, not feeling like your message is enough, not feeling like your breakthrough is enough, that you have to try to please people, that you have to try to, you know, alter your message and fix your message in order to make it make sense for everyone. But I'm here to tell you that that is, you know, false. You don't need to do that. There will be people that will get your message. There will be people that will change from your message. There will be people that will be impacted and altered and their lens will change, their perspective will change, their mind will change, and they'll message you and they'll be so excited about it. And then there will be people that will not get it. They won't like it. They'll want you to change it. They'll want you to alter it. They'll tell you you should do it this way and that way. And they'll tell you how you're wrong, this, that, and the other. But stay focused and stay your path because what your your breakthrough, what you went through, what you feel guided to speak, what you feel guided to share, what you feel... Uh, is the truth for you if it truly feels like it is your truth and you experience breakthrough based on that truth share it it's your it comes from your soul it comes from the spirit within you it comes from the holy spirit that's within you and there are people that will be altered by it so don't hold back be be bold be proud of what you have to share and don't try to please people because like I said, a lot of us get caught in that trap of uh, people pleasing and trying to fix and alter our message to get everyone to understand it. And not everyone will, you know. Um, I mean, even looking at Jesus' ministry, if you want to go uh, that far back, uh, that it's a really good example because there were so, he had so many haters. I mean, a lot of people now, you know, when they step out and they start sharing you know their own truth there there will be haters there will be people that don't get it and guess what that's okay you're not here to please people you're not here uh for everyone to understand and for everyone to get it you're not that's not what your purpose is that's not what you were called to do that's not what your um ministry is what you are here to do is speak what's true for you what breakthroughs that you experience what uh, life-changing messages and truths have altered your life, how your perspective has changed in a better, uh, bigger way, and that's all you're here to do, is to uh, put your heart out there, put your message out there, put your uh, truth out there, your breakthroughs, your experiences, and do it boldly, um, and do it proud, and, and just speak it, tell the truth, and stop being afraid of people, stop being afraid, and stop trying to please everyone because it's impossible to please everyone. Everyone has their own opinion, their own perspective, uh, the way they view things. And so just quit, quit that, um, quit that being in that trap of people pleasing. So anyway, guys, I just wanted to encourage you to share your truth, share your message, share what you're passionate about, share what lights you up, what ignites you, um, what, you know, what altered your life, share it with the, with the world, share it with people. And you'll be surprised that when you put your stuff out there, when you put your message out there, you'll be surprised at how many people you impact, how many people you will influence, how many p uh, messages you will get, how many comments you will receive uh, from people that are saying, "Wow, like what you have, what you said, like the message that you you spoke on today, or the truth that you shared, or whatever." It doesn't even have to be like a crazy huge breakthrough. It could just be simple daily life things that you're going through, and you share it and. You know, a mom can, on the other side of the world, can get it and be like, wow, that, you know, that really helped me. So don't, don't worry about your message not being enough. Don't worry about trying to please everyone. Um, whatever you have on your heart, you know, that's helped you, that's altered your life in any way, shape, or form, put it out there, share it. The world needs to hear it more than you realize. The, the world needs more people like you and I who are up, out there uplifting, um, who are changing mindsets, who are changing perspectives perspectives the world needs more people like us there's not enough people out there so don't be afraid get yourself out there share 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 i wish you all the best i love you guys and i'll see you in the next video